Superstar. Okay, sorry about that. Hello, humans. This is Super Alex here, and today we are here to talk about the top ten things you can do while you're stuck in the uh, quarantine. Ain't it funny how you live an introvert and staying in the house within more than days or even weeks or even a year? They call it a quarantine, but introverts we just called it hermit life. I don't get that, but okay, whatever. Yes, I'm an introvert, but sometimes I do like going out, and I know the struggles of not going out when you can't. So, YouTube's going to probably not allow this, but there's a coronavirus going on. I'm not going to get into detail. If you want to know more about the virus and more stuff that's not out of proportion or fake media or fake news... Or the news not going crazy about it. Because there are some social media that is blowing this more proportion than it should. And not telling the truth on media. If you want to know the truth, I would put a link down below about uh, DeFranco uh, show. And what he is, he's a great YouTuber. He talks about the news and stuff. He's like a news, he's like News Channel 5, but for YouTube. He's like a news channel but for YouTube. And he does his research. He knows exactly what he's talking about. He's not a professional. But in his opinion. In my opinion. He does tell the truth. Nothing but the truth. He gives you true facts. Of what's going on. Just throwing it out there. But uh, Danny DeFranco. His channel will be down to b below. One of the coronavirus videos will be down below. Please check him out. If you want to know more. I will not get too much into detail about the virus. But I will talk about what you can do while you're stuck at home and you cannot leave your house. Some areas you cannot leave your house. It's safer at home, blah, blah, blah. Whatever. Uh, everyone's heard this already. But some people can leave their house at free will. But it's recommended if you stay at home. Please stay at home. Watch them hands. Wash your hands. You shouldn't have had the government telling you this already. You should have washed your hands way before. I'm not shaming you. I'm just saying washing your hands is very important. Do it every day. I do it. You do it. Anyway, Superstar. Uh, just random. Just gonna say that through the, out through the whole video. Anyway, uh, there are 10 things you can do while you're at home, stuck at home. It, extra folks can do this. Introverts can do this. Rich people can do this. Poor people can do this. This video will relate to all kinds of people. And I know some people are struggling with finance and uh money issues and they can't afford internet cable or anything like that when i was little i was poor my mom didn't buy me a uh, xbox when it came out she bought me a ds when the playstation came out game boy nes came out i played the nes while there was a playstation 3 coming out so i understand what it's like struggling with money being poor and stuff like that we have gotten better finance is still worse i'm still poor as heck, but I'm trying my best, the best I can. And I have upgraded from uh, antenna TV to cable and internet a little. So yay me. I work in a warehouse. That's what helped me the most. And my job, the warehouse works for Kogel. So um, I'm still open. Uh, my job is still open. We can't work from home. We have to work in a warehouse. We have to keep the store Kogel in stock. I won't name the warehouse I'm working at, but I will say it's for the store of Kroger. And hopefully that doesn't get me fired during this video. But anyway, let's do this. Number one, playing video games. If you're an extrovert, then you can play video games like VR. Yeah, you're still not outside, but VR can give you so many experiences. Such as going outside in virtual reality going to disneyland or going to amusement parks and you know just hanging out with other people in the vr chat room that's pretty great but if you never play video games and you would like to try something new while you're stuck at home just buy a video game and try it out you might like it you might not if you don't you can give it to your cousin donate it to someone that in need or something like that but if you can't afford video games you can play games normal games around the house like hide and seek and stuff like that but i like to play nintendo and i just like to play super smash ball because who doesn't like super smash ball where well, you can kick some butt but playing video games totally recommend it in my opinion but i'm a gamer at heart all the time 
If that doesn't do you, then let's go to number two on top ten cool things of what you can do. If there's anything else you want to do, if you're not a big game or person, that's okay. Number two, you can read a book. I know that might sound boring or maintain, but sometimes it's okay to just relax and open a book and just read the story. And it makes you feel like you're there in the story, adventures that hold it up and stuff like that. Find out what's in a book. Don't judge a book by its cover. Uh, if you want to check out this book, it'll be down link in the below. But not only that, but I like to watch, read books about real people that done real things. Like Ghost Adventure, Seth Bayon, and what he's done through his life. If you don't know, I'm just a big fan of Sack Bay and Ghost Adventures and stuff like that. And I just like reading into a book and learning about ghosts and mystery and demons and stuff like that. So read a book if you can. If you're not into reading a book, download Audible. Listen to audiobooks. If you can't afford audiobooks or Audible, there's some free Audible books to listen to on YouTube if you have internet or mobile data. And I know how it is having mobile data. Not being unlimited because I had a 45 minute unlimited plan and after a while it would slow down my Wi-Fi. It did not work after a while. My phone, they just, you know, did not work. It was slow as heck and I used one of those calls. You had to scratch the number and, you know, call and figure it out. So I understand about data. You have to be consistent on your data. But, you know, just read one at a time and little as little and maybe it won't run your data. But reading a book can be fun and insightful. You can even learn so much from books and figure out that you're actually a nerd and you actually like books. There's Harry Potter, there's Zach Fagan, there's Little Big Brother, there's uh, I Am a or Boss by uh, Lily Singh. You can read books about YouTubers, about adventures, about manga. Manga's a book, kind of. You can read that and get into anime and stuff like that, basically. So if I was you, I would read a book on number two if you want to relax. But if you're not into that, let's get into number three. Number three can be spring cleaning. You know, get a little cleaning done or remodel the house. My family downstairs has painted the living room. As for me, I'm going to put my clothes in this basket. And go through my clothes. See what I don't want and what I do want. Figure out which I keep, what which I wear mostly and which I don't wear mostly. Anyway, get some spring cleaning done. Plant a garden outside. You can go out into your yard, I think, unless it's against the law where you live. Or, you know, just clean up the house. Paint the walls. Wash the walls. Paint the walls. Redecorate your office. Do stuff like that, you know. Spring cleaning slash remodeling and also you're part of what my mom did with the living room that being said so uh so my family is being loud while i'm recording but that's okay we're gonna see what they're doing what y'all complaining about Hmm. Yeah. Y'all having fun painting? By the way, I'm recording y'all. No. Come on, wait, wait, wait. Let's get to number four of the list. Watch Come On Minds, or any show you like to get into, like Supernatural, Netflix has all kinds of shows you have never watched in a long time. Or you can watch Hulu, basically any old shows that's been a while. Like me, I would <laughs> watch, we watched the My Little Pony season, Friendship is Magic. Why? Because I just loved My Little Pony since I was little. Or since I've been in middle school, it wasn't out that long. Anyway, 
that is number four. Okay, number five of the cool ten, you can try a new hobby. This can involve many things, like get into a really nice book, like I said, reading. Or, write your own book. This is a book I wrote in middle school called The High Boots. It was about half human, half animal anime story. And I'm thinking about putting it on what I have thought of putting it on Wattpad, but I've been so busy with stuff that I haven't done it yet. But it'll be on my Wattpad. And that's where you can write free stories. So it's fanfiction.com, uh, web novels, uh, there's comic books you can make. They were all also Wattpads. I like Wattpad. People hate on it, say it's not good, but there was actually some good story on Wattpads. I will put the link down below on Wattpad of mine and a friend of mine that does Wattpad. And she got some pretty good stories. Another thing you can do is draw. This is my digital art, along with this and these. These are my digital artworks I do out of my free time when I have time. I quit drawing. Nevertheless, I quit drawing online like these is because I just didn't have time anymore. By the way, that's Fire Flame. And this is Button Mist. This is Sour Cream. This is Sleepy Trail. These are these these are the four ponies that I'm friends with that are my OCs in the My Little Pony community. And here's a selfie of them. Well, here's a full on picture of them. And it's because I love My Little Pony and I'm still into My Little Pony. You can also listen to you YouTubers' hobbies, watch speed paints and stuff like that, basically. But number four, just find a new hobby, get into it, and enjoy it. Is there something where you would inspire by some people, like cooking or drawing or writing a book? Well, go ahead and do it. I did it. Ta-da! So you can do it, too. Yeah. Okay, number six, treat yourself. And if you want to know how you can treat yourself, it is stalking here. First things first, let's take a nice hot bath. I will not be showing my clothes off because I'm not about that lifestyle. I'm wearing a man's underwear and a t-shirt. Because, yeah, I wear guys' underwear. That's no surprise. And this is what music I'm listening to. It'll be in the description below if you want to listen to classical anime music. So, let me just... And you just relax, listen to classical music in the background, and drink some wine. I got what tomorrow, but I will. And especially if you're a parent, you're getting stuck with your kids for a while due to the school routine or stuff like that have an hour of just relaxing go in the bathroom set you a nice hot bubble bath sit in it drink some wine listen to some classical music or watch some tv while doing it like i do another thing you can do is listen to music slash walk out to so i don't get copyright and also i hope alley hills don't mind because i love alley hills who does it Check her out, it should be down in the link below too. Everything that's in this video will be down, link in the below. But just rock out to music or listen to it. There we go. Let's skip. Skip to the. Those are there. You needed the hang of space. You don't even mind. You don't waste time Filling in all the blanks I wish you were sad for a day So you would know how it tastes to be Dance to music or you can sit down and Can you get yourself? 
Oh, just, you know, dance to music like I did there. And, Allie Hills, please don't sue me. I'll put your link down below of that music. And, yeah, pretty much listen to Allie Hills. And watch her YouTube channel because she's pretty dope. Pretty dope. I love her. Uh, we survey her one day, but that's just my opinion. She's an idol I look up to. Anyway, yeah, that's number five. Number seven, what you can do, you can also watch YouTube videos or, you know, yeah, watch YouTube videos. It's pretty fun, and let me see if I can get Allie Hughes back up on you. Okay. Yeah. Yep, she's the first thing on my sub's history. And... Just sit here on my dragon and just watch yeah, okay. endless YouTube videos like Allie Hills. Does that look like I read it? Okay. Oh, mistakes are being made. Beautiful. Uh oh, I'm already in. How did this happen so quickly? Just gonna stir it up. Yes, there was my queen. If music I queen, you a day hollow. No other circumstance would I enjoy this. Cheers, bitches, to the first drink of the video. <laughs> okay, turns out I don't know what I'm talking about. This isn't that bad. <laughs> you can't taste the vodka. But, like, why do I already feel hungover? Uh, you can make this for your enemy if you want them to have it. Anyway, you can watch YouTube videos, not just her, but you can watch Jaden animations, animators like that, or Lost Narrator, <laughs> a recommendation along with my pal that listens to, that will read fan fiction, or do comment things, and I will put their link down below too, if you want to check them out, so yeah, watch YouTube videos, that's another thing you can do out of your free time, of oh, the seven reasons of what to do. Number eight, yeah, number eight, you can sleep all day. Sleep until this whole virus goes away, until you wake up. And they say, hey, you can go back outside and this whole thing's over with now. Oh, shoot, let me sit. You just lay down, get your stitch cover. If you don't have a stitch cover, then what are you doing with your life? No, but for real, just lay down. Take your glasses off, can't sleep with glasses on because they'll kill you and just go to sleep. Mm, I love sleep so much. Who doesn't love to sleep? Sleep is like the best thing ever. Just lay down. And you don't even have to sleep. You could just lay here and do nothing. Just relax. Mm. Oh, that's actually a yawn. I didn't think it would actually yawn on the man. Uh, this is just be relaxed. Do nothing. Be lazy. Have a lazy day. Do nothing but be lazy. Lay in bed. Go to sleep if you want. Or watch TV. It's up to you. It's what you want. And that's what I think number eight used to do when in quarantine. Just sleep the day away. 
sleep weeks, even months, and see see if this thing will go away. This whole awful mess of 2020 go away. And maybe when you wake up, everything will be fine. And it's all just a dream. Number 10 is just make YouTube videos. If you're really bored out of your mind, there's a really nice community. YouTube, you can post anything you want. You can do speed art. You can do gaming. You can do flaws. You can talk about how 2020 sucked so far. Or you can even talk about what you're doing during your quarantine. I bet a lot of people can relate to you. YouTube or Twitter or Instagram or Facebook or whatever you use, just post videos and just make fun of things. Or even Twitch. I hear Twitch is very popular with people. You can do a lot of things for YouTube and make the community grow even better. And people will love you no matter what you do. You don't have to be pretty. You don't have to look beautiful. You don't have to be famous for being... Pretty. I'm sorry, but actors are usually pretty, and that's how they're famous, is their beauty, but you don't have to be pretty. You can have a talent in anything, even if you suck at everything. I suck at everything, and here I am making YouTube videos about how I suck at everything. Alex Misfit, it's in the name. I'm a misfit in society because I never belong in the small country town of Tennessee. Hee-haw. Oh my gosh, that was the worst person ever. You can talk about anything you want on YouTube or do whatever you want on YouTube. YouTube is a free community. It's YouTube for a reason. Anyway, that's what you should do for number 10. And, well, that's it. But in all seriousness, or seriousness, there is a lot you can do in a quarantine. I like to sleep, play video, I like to sleep, play video games, watch YouTube, read a book, and just generally sleep <laughs> what can i say i love sleep sleep is my favorite along with doing gaming and doing youtube and stuff and it's not being lazy there's nothing to do while you're trapped in a house so do what you want to do for once since you have all this free time do all the things you couldn't do before like write a book i bet there was a book you ever wanted to write have you ever had any ideas if so comment down below of any ideas you wanted to do with while you were at the house Stuck at the house and you never did because you had to go work or do something with your life. But since everyone's staying at home, do what you want to do. What makes you happy, generally. Anyway, that's what I do. The top 10 things I do. If you guys like this video, please comment down below of what you're going to do during your quarantine. And I hope you are financially okay. If not, there are some donations on Facebook and stuff like that. You should check it out if you can. And if you don't have Wi-Fi... I understand I just got Wi-Fi on my own, or if you don't, you're using mobile data to watch this, you're probably like, see, how is someone watching this? You can watch YouTube, but on a crappy mobile data, and it both was ever so often like this. And anyway, today's about, it just both was a lot. Anyway, you guys, I hope everything goes okay, and yeah, 2020 just sucked so far. I hope a reset happened. The only good thing that happened was Doom and Animal Crossing. And that was a real condition, uh, real thing that happened right when California shut down. So I was like, wait, I don't believe in a guy, but that, that's just suspicious right there. Anyway, there's a lot of things you can do for YouTube. Like I said, all the videos I showed or all the links down below or the music and stuff like that I use will be down in the link below. So if you want to check out those incredible YouTubers I show or mention along with the song I listen to, uh, Treat Yourself and stuff like that, please check down the link below. They're really great people, work really hard, and Alley Hills is amazing. That's just my opinion at the end. Anyway, I hope you guys like this video. Don't forget to put the like button on the nose. Love you guys. Hawks to you all around. And see you in the next video. Bye-bye, sucker. Luna, baby, I'm trying to record here. Can you go back in the room and watch your TV? Hey! Don't be chewing on the box. Oh, come here.